Welcome to Madrid, the capital city of Spain, on a picture-perfect day. Two teams left standing for a FIBA world title, the championship game between Serbia and Team USA. Kevin Connors, Fran Fraschilla, thrilled to be with you. Two very different paths to this title game for these two teams, Fran. Averaging in double figures, but the key today may well be the defense of Kyrie Irving. Well, starting, I think he's going to start on Taya Dosich. There'll be a couple people that get a piece of him, including Kay Thompson, Clay Thompson. But I look for Irving to get him early. Really important to the culture. FIBA eyeing its first World Cup medal since 2002. We know they will do that. Of course, for Team USA, a shot at its fifth FIBA World Cup gold medal. The winner of this game gets the lone automatic bid to the Rio Virtually Olympics. All man to man. Kenneth Fareed, free throw line jumper breaks the ice. Able to get into it yet. Serbia has switched well on the perimeter. Here's Harden drawing a foul and an opportunity to complete the three point play. All that time out last time, Fran. What's the message in the huddle? I think Coach K is just trying to calm him down a little bit. You know what I like about that right there? And Harden, if they can. Here's Harden drawing another foul. He's so good at that, Fran. He's done it throughout this tournament. They worked hard to make him get the ball that he was able to get to the lane. And now Cousins. Bats it off the rim, and you can do that in FIBA play. We've seen Serbia, that being a strength of this team. They've been so good at knocking balls off the rim as Harden tries a three. That's huge. Is spread it out and allow these guys to make some plays. Big time blocked by Cousins that time, and he's fouled by Nikola Kalinic. Well, we remind you that Monday Night Football brings you a meeting between a pair of division champs as we take another look at the defense by Cousins. Really nice job by DeMarcus Cousins. Davis in foul trouble. He has to be very active because he's got a push. In the game for Serbia as Bielica misfired on the three. Team USA now in the midst of a 7-0 run. Make it 9-0. I like that. And I like the fact that... Off the penetration, Nanat Kristic missing from in close and another rebound for DeMarcus Cousins. See if Irving does it again. Pull up three for Kyrie Irving. Elitza drops it off. Kristich unable to finish from in close again. Two big misses by Kristich, who's playing this tournament hurt. Irving all the way. Now, Kyrie Irving quietly has had an exceptional tournament. He's been very efficient. Here's Boogie Cousins, knocks down the 18-footer. See, that's the count. In Boston Celtic. Here's Irving, he's feeling it. How about this? How about this? The Elites' second effort by Gay is contested. Wow. And three out of the wow. corner by Clay Thompson. Talk about unconscious. That's been, uh, no question, but watch this little handoff. Clay Thompson, corner three. Plumley. Rudy Gay get no, they caught fire halfway through. Kyrie Irving really has been the catalyst, and he continues to be the catalyst. This is impressive. 15 points. He's six of seven from the field. And the <laughs> USA lead is 16. It's made his threes. Take a look. The numbers are good. This is not a uh, surprise tonight, but getting Team USA off in the first quarter as quickly as he did really did a half and you got to crowd him and pick and roll lay thompson to three how about the shooting of team usa two at the rim for the three and they got it milos teodosic averaging 12 and a half points per game irving all the way it's tipped in by farid once again irving causing havoc with the serbia defense He's the little girl with the curl. He can be very, very good sometimes. And he off but turns it over. Uh, good hands by Markovic. And more good hands. Rose to Kenneth Fareed. And if we were to pick an MVP of Team USA, I think he might be your guy. Well, he, he, he would be certainly one of my top candidates. Anthony Davis as well. James Harden's come on. You know what? Clay Thompson off the bench is back magnificent. But on that last defensive position for Reed and Davis. Thompson's three. No. Look at the follow-up by Gay. 
Rudy Gay. To correct myself, that was the second foul called on Ronalitza as Gay drills a three, he scored the last. For about a two minute stretch that opened this game up. He's got a mismatch right now. Let's see how Serbia handles it. He fires from behind the arc again. Kyrie Irving has 18 points in this first half. Kyrie Irving has dominated this game. And you know what? He's made that jumper all tournament long. Came in shooting near 50%. Another mismatch. Harden, step back three for the U.S. The lead is up to 26. Game. Battered away by Cousins. Here's Harden, all the way to the rim. And that started with DeMarcus Cousins again. He didn't leave his feet until he absolutely had to. That's good help, D, again. Three-point front rim by Kalinic. Another rebound by Cousins. And another three on the way by Curry. That might be his first basket. Good help defense by Kyrie Irving. Look at the leading scorers for Team USA. Been an impressive first half. Serbia, they have so much pride in their basketball. It's, uh, you know, theoretically, the vet can, can't say anything about FIBA officials in this game. It's kind of gone both ways. We said it would be called close. Hard and a three. The U.S. is 12 of 16 from three-point range. James Harden, watch this. That's too easy. Remember, this Serbia team, because Davis has the three fouls. Kyrie Irving answering. Cousins all the way, and he's fouled on his way up, and they'll that, call an intentional yes. foul, friend. And that's going to be a, a an unsportsmanlike foul. Teodosic, this is common for him. When things aren't going well, he'll he'll be in the middle of it. I love that Cousins is just staying calm. The other day, we saw him almost react to, <laughs> to Valanciunas and to getting into a back-and-forth game with the lead now. It was definitely a hard foul by Radulica. Well, I don't know that it was necessarily... Well, Cousins came down, right. in fairness, he right. hit Bielitz in the back of the head. As Cousins knocks down the first. And so it is an unsportsmanlike foul. Team USA should get this ball back. They play with a lot of pride. They did likely not take well to being blown out in that first half. There's Harden and lost it on his way. Oh, good challenge. That might have been Cousins again. And they'll get a foul called on uh, Serbia. It's Kalinic. I think Radu Litsa may have had a case here, Fran. Let's take another look. Let's see. Uh, I, I don't know. They haven't called. Here's Harden. No on the three, but the follow-up by DeMarcus Cousins. Here's Harden off the drive. Elbow jumper, and James Harden continues to shoot it well today. Consistent offense in the pick and roll game. For Reed, no. And Teodosic with a good, smart play. Now there's Harden taking it at the rim. And when Team USA shoots 11 of 15 from three point range in the first half, and there's Anthony Davis. Good disruption overall defensively. Three by Bogdanovich, drafted this past summer by the Phoenix Suns. He played very well in the semifinal game as Irving is left open, and he knocks down a three. That Irving, not again, yes again. Unbelievable. Brilliant in this game, combining with James Harden for 49 points. Team USA comfortably in control here in the third. Later, the Olympic coach, but he was one of those guys that the pioneers, the UB Browns, the Jack Ramsey, most satisfying uh, win if they are able to hold on and win the gold at a time with which to pick our best 12 and even though this might not be the best 12 this is still a great 12. there's DeRozan another basket Cer certainly not Argentina 
Jovic knocks down the jumper. The alley-oop to Anthony Davis. And Team USA hits 100, still with 140 to go in the third quarter. In addition to Spain in 2016. It's tough to say. You know, I think Spain certainly will be, certainly will be there if they qualify. But uh, here you see what we were talking about since 2004. Coach K taking over that loss to Greece in the semifinals, the only loss. He said that was a real education that day because hurt us. He's so much more conversant in the international game and foul trouble. Jump hook. There's Fareed's move. Pointer on the way by Beercevic. And now Fareed leading the break. Thompson free throw line jumper is smooth. Shevsky. As we see the last three major international yes. tournaments, all gold for Team USA. How would you characterize well, what Jerry Colangelo has I'll done? I'll tell you what Coach K told me in New York. He said, I can be replaced. He said, they'll hire a really B.A. exhibition garbage time. Team USA has proven their point. As Clay Thompson drilled. Part of being around these guys at training camp and on the exhibition tour, and they've handled themselves incredibly games there's Clay Thompson That's ridiculous. again yeah I mean the shooting That's ridiculous we saw Not great in the NBA in college I totally agree we've talked about that a lot yep I don't love all the FIBA rules but that is one that needs to come to the US is Rudy G that having been said this is a historic moment for as I've said a country that absolutely loves its basketball Rose nice throws it up yep. in nice redirection so many of these Serbian kids I've watched and coached for a number big fella I stand corrected <laughs> here's Curry left open Steph Curry another three man the 15th of the game for Team USA one more basket from Team USA and they will set the new mark Curry no but Andre Drummond will do so 129 points for Team USA you know this reminds me an awful lot of 92 and 96 that's the scary part that's why I say you know the world Basketball is more popular than ever around the world, and there's some outstanding young international stars. James Harden and Team USA led a dynamic, spectacular shooting performance, and Team USA are the gold medal winners of the 2014 FIBA Basketball World Cup. time we sent college players that changed in 94 98 we sent uh, the equivalent of D League players 2002 things started to unravel coach K took over in 2006 only loss suffered to Greece and now uh, a juggernaut I want you to bring your bodies I want you to bring your minds and I want you to bring your hearts those three things have to happen every game. Team USA, they got all the pressure in the world to win these games. You got a chance to represent a whole country and to be able to, you know, be that person to bring back that gold medal is it's a huge honor. It does give me goosebumps and chills thinking about hopefully kind of that vision of where we're going to be, you know, come the end of the World Cup. The United States about to clinch themselves Group C. Words can't explain it. I mean, be a part of this atmosphere, just stuff you dream about. I have one gold medal already, but to win two, this can be huge. It's an honor. It's a privilege. The United States uh, cruising on its way toward a 5-0 and mark. It feels like no other, you know, you're not only just playing for yourself, you're playing for the whole country, and it's just an unbelievable feeling to get that opportunity. United States lob and Fareed with the jam. And so the United States to once again reach the semifinals. In order to win, you have to be worthy of winning. And what does worthy of winning mean? It means that you're playing as one. You're working hard together. You're unselfish. This group is worthy of winning. And the United States advancing to the gold medal game. Big time, though. Big time win. Big time team win. Trying to go for that goal. Next step.